everyone, what's up? This is Patrick from Guy in the Cube, and in this Two Minute Tuesday, I'm gonna show you how to customize your visualization pane in Power BI Desktop. All right, since this is Two Minute Tuesday, you guys know I like to do, instead of all this talking, let's do what? Head over to my laptop. All right, so to get started with customizing your visualization pane, the first thing you need to do is enable it because it's a preview feature. So you click File, you go to Options and Settings, and you click Options. A couple of seconds, the option window will open, and all you need to do is go to preview features and check the box for personalized visualization pane and click OK. You may need to restart the desktop to get that feature enabled. It's OK. Do it. Once you do that, then you can begin to customize your visualization pane. So let's take, for example, maybe you found a custom visual you want to replace a native visual with. So you can remove that native visual or maybe you are like me. You want to be don't want to be tempted to use the glorious pie chart. All right. So instead of using the pie chart, I'm gonna use the donut chart, it's a pie with a hole in it. Um, and then what I can do, because I've enabled that preview feature, I can remove the pie chart from my visualization pane, right? So I click okay, and it moves it here, okay? Anytime, any new instance of Power BI Desktop that I open, that pie chart is gonna be removed. So let me show you, all right? If I go here on a new instance of the desktop, you see there's no pie chart there. So I'm not tempted to use it. I just, I want to use it so bad, but now it's gone and I can't use it. That's okay. That's okay, right? So we'll go back to the original report. And so, you know, now it's gone. How do I bring them back? What if I decide I do want to use pie charts? Really easy. All you got to do is click the ellipsis and say restore default visuals and it'll bring all those visuals that you've unpinned back to it. And this is great, right? This is in the desktop. But there's two things I want to point out to you. What happens when I publish this to the service? Well, let's see. So once I publish this report to the service, I'll go to this report and then watch this. What if I go into edit mode? So I click the ellipsis, I go into edit mode. Will we see the pie chart? Of course you will, because it's a desktop feature, right? And so if you don't want to be tempted to use this pie chart, don't create reports in the service. The same, the last thing, the same goes for the data set. If I go to the data set for this report, for this, for that report, and I try to create a report based on the data set, there's a pie chart, okay? So be very careful, right? You'll still be tempted. They won't be nice and tight like they are in the desktop. So create all your reports in the desktop if you don't want to be tempted to use the pie, the pie chart, all right? So what do you guys think? You got any questions, comments? You know what to do. Post them in the comments below. It's your first time visiting the guy in the cube channel hit that subscribe button you like my video big thumbs up as always from adam and myself thanks for watching we'll see you in the next video